slowly through corners number three and four. They'll hit the Knott start can in corner number four. Green flag goes in the air. We're underway at Terre Haute. Melby already trying to go ahead on the break, but quickly to the inside, Justin Grant goes to the race lead. Justin Grant already out in front. Bilby trying to run him back down, side by side for third. McDougal and Thomas, they'll work for that final podium spot. Bilby trying to battle back to the inside, but coming to the completion of lap one, Justin Grant could be your race leader. Three wide for second. McDougal goes to second. Kevin Thomas Jr. trying to follow suit into that number three spot. Thomas Jr. still charging. Brady Bacon still back there as well. Grant works to the inside of the lap machine of Eric Gentry. Kevin Thomas Jr. takes it to the top shelf. Grant. Oh, he lost a lot of time coming off the second corner. That lets Thomas close in really quickly. Side by side through corners three and four. Justin Grant knows that Kevin Thomas Jr. is there now. Let's see how much is still in reserve for the four car. Grant out in front. Thomas charging in second. Tyler Courtney up to third. Tyler Courtney got past the 69 machine of Brady Bacon. Second and third now within just a couple of tenths of one another. Here comes Courtney to the inside of Kevin Thomas Jr. Thomas Jr. has the advantage. He'll hold the second spot. Oh, he gets crossed up a little bit, goes up the racetrack. Courtney takes a peek to the inside for the number two spot. Could be Courtney's chance to pounce. Kevin Thomas Jr. holds the advantage going down the back stretch. Courtney's still right on his back tail tank. Could get him off the corner. Side by side, though, work. Brady Bacon's back there as well. Second, third, and fourth, all under a blanket. Down the front stretch, they come once again with 10 laps to go. Here comes Courtney. Again, to the inside of Kevin Thomas Jr. He may get the advantage down the back stretch. Tyler Courtney goes up into the runner up spot. Courtney will get the runner up spot, and he will close the position on Kevin Thomas Jr. as Jr. tries to fight it back. But Tyler Courtney just too strong. Kevin Thomas Jr. Goes back into that number three. On the restart, Sunshine, Tyler Courtney shoots to the inside of Justin Grant. Can Grant battle back on the outside? Indeed he can. Grant rim riding his way back to the lead. Kevin Thomas Jr. shoots to the inside of Courtney, and Kevin Thomas Jr. goes into the runner-up spot. We knew it was going to get wild and woolly here in the final five laps. Now Kevin Thomas Jr., he'll set his sail for the race lead. Justin Grant, just a little too strong down the straightaway. We saw what Grant could do in clean air earlier. We'll see what he can do here in the closing stages. It appears that Kevin Thomas Jr. closing in ever so slightly. They round corners three and four once again. Three laps to go at the line this time by. Grant making that top shelf work. No lap traveling in front of them. Final trip down the back straightaway. Grant throws the lead ever so slightly. Working his way through corners number three and four. Your winner here tonight at the Terre Haute Action Track in the Jim Herdebees Classic will go to Ione, California's Justin Grant. There to greet him in victory lane, up and out of the race car. Your race winner here tonight in the Jim Herdebees Classic, the four car, Justin Grant, as he's going to do the cage stand and smash the NOS can here in victory lane at Terre Haute.